Bismillahirrahmanirrahim in our series for crash course on ChatGPT. Today uh, we are going to create a book summary using ChatGPT and uh, we'll try our best to get the most out of this book. So let's start by instructing ChatGPT on how to act. So we'll say act as the author of and in quotation eat that rock. Briefly explain what the book is generally about. So as you can see in very general terms it has provided a very beautiful explanation of what the book is about. Now uh, we will instruct ChatGBT to write a summary for us. Write a brief summary of the above book. Now we'll ask ChatGBT to list a few highlights from the book. Now that we are given the highlights of the book, uh, we would want uh, ChatGPT to list a few actionable points from the book, the points based on which we can take actions. As you can see, ChatGPT has provided us with very important actionable points that we have to apply them into our life. But in order to polish this even better, we'll ask ChatGPT what daily changes should I bring in my life based on this book. It will give us a few points which will tell us how to apply the book into our life. Now we'll ask ChatGPT a further step that can help us to teach other people using this book. So we'll pose the question, what can I teach others from this book? This will help us discuss the details of the book with other people uh, and it will give us some actionable points that are hot topics for discussion. And now we will ask ChatGPT to write a takeaway from reading this book. Obviously, uh, you can take these points and uh, you can convert this into a video or um, you can use this summary for your blog and also for other social media platforms. And if you want, you can ask ChatGPT to give you a video description and video narration in order to make a video of this book summary. And then you can publish it on YouTube so that you can make money using this technique. Thank you very much for watching. Next time, we are going to discuss how we can use ChatGPT to help us with our assignments, homeworks, and many other activities in the academic sector.